What is up? Welcome back to F1 Manager. Don't really need to say anything else. Just say, look, let's get into this episode, really. We're back. Episode 7. As you can see, Weather Center, we've literally had just done Imla. It was a quite of a dull race. I think we ended up doing a split strategy for the first time. And it didn't really work out for one of the drivers. The other one it almost did. But yeah, we're now into Monaco this week. Monaco this episode, which I think is going to be a pretty bad one. And unsurprisingly, side pods and suspension has failed. They were at a high level weather forecast. F2 driver talent. Ooh. That's the thing. I need to, th I need to think who I can sign. Daruvla might be. Ooh, okay, hold on. Response. Concern about the entry. The data seems to be consistent and there's been no impact on. But the main rotor isn't starting up or winding down as maybe it once did. So that would be pushed back. And that would be pushed back. And that would be pushed back, and it's just the designs. For nine days, I'm honestly not pissed about it. I'll, I'll, you know, I, I, I confirm that because I don't want to have any risks. But inspection has failed on two cars. Side pods. Uh, we are currently developing side pods, but we will just replace them. On both of them. Yeah, so we will just wait. We really have nothing. It's just a week. So we'll just head in. Hopefully we get more stuff. Okay, that, that's good. So I can actually put that chassis on Gasly's car. Yeah, that's a decent improvement. Uh, higher, medium, low speed. Where are we on low speed? Uh, it doesn't matter. Um, let me go into car analysis. Okay, we're actually better than the majority of the grid on low speed now. That's actually pretty good. We're eleventh. So yeah, it's now our it's actually now our medium speed. It's like we are actually building a decent car. It looks like. Which is nice to know. Another part, I think that might be our next side pod. Hold on, let me have a quick let me have a quick look in our cart depart development. So yeah, these are being shut down for nine days. That's fine. Yes, side pod is the next one that gets manufactured. Suspension. So what are we actually needing? Two, two, two. Okay, they're all two, except for suspension. Um, no, hold on, let me see. I'm going to give that to Gasly. Mainly because I think it's only fair. Front wing has a 38% chance. 11%. Okay. Oh, new... I will put that on Albon's car then. And that means he. Yeah, you know what? That, I'm gonna do that. That seems fair. So hold on. I know this seems kind of. I should have done this now. Let me go grab my other car. So. Hmm. 
one day we went from 15th and 9th to now 17th and 12th and 15th. Oh no. People have made massive upgrades. We've just dropped four places. Alright, so I didn't do any practice programs. Uh, not practice programs, the performance targets. Because I was happy, and now I'm not. The fact that we're now, we went from P11 to P15 in low speed in the matter of one single day, which just shows the upgrades people put on in one day. And yeah, um, you're going to just see me do this car set up here. And about to head into practice, and then next time we'll see each other. We'll be time in for qualifying, so I want to make sure we do well. Monaco might be a very boring race, so I will apologize in advance if this race is quite boring. I mean, I feel like that's where we're gonna be like that. Traction's so important in Monaco, I think. I think like we did that, some, something like this, like that. I'm gonna do that with Albon. Also, old engine in because I need to do this. Um, so yeah, as you can see, we have side pod spec 1, even though we do have a spec 2. And we have, so yeah, I think the upgrades when they all, when all these last, probably the last ones do get on. Like, I will sacrifice, uh, so suspension is done. That's one thing, the second uh, that suspension, I will, that will be my first one I research. And I think I'm gonna research that the second I get uh, development time, uh, ATR period. I think that might be our only shot. At this rate, uh, only shot at this rate. I'm gonna do that and get as much traction as possible. All right. So I. All righty then. We have done practice. I don't think this race is going to go well for us. Don't mind these times. This is worn engine components. So our our engines, we're not using our freshest engines because it's kind of a waste. But I have had a look at that ERS and the fact that we only get two of them kind of sucks. Because we're almost through our first Every single one will be through its first call, and the ERS has only even hasn't even made it six or seven races. Gearbox, yes. So. Get that fresh engine in. Get that fresh, fresh-ish gearbox in. I speak. Get their fresh, fresh engine. Get Gasly's engine in. Get the second gearbox in. I think the cutoff's 30%. Minimum lifespan. 59%. I look at our engine suppliers. Ooh. This is actually interesting to look at. Um, can we look at our engine suppliers? Eventually, I'm gonna have to look at Mercedes engines because I don't think they have good durability. I think I might have to move. Um, we'll not change anything. Pointless. Let's get into qualifying though. So yeah, we might have to get our starting stuff done. Yeah, it's gonna be fine. Fleets are completely dry. We can, we're not like a wet Monica right now. That's great. 
send them out, let them do their first lap, hopefully not in the Monaco traffic, as soon as I say that, the Monogas driver, Charles Leclerc, comes out the pit box, and he's just going to hold us up. That is, that is so annoying. Yeah, I have a problem. Copy, stand by. Oh, it's 40. Okay, so just keep it on the delta. Just be slightly negative if you can. Alright, well, if Gaz has got an issue, that's annoying. fine. Bricks it's ear yeah. That will do for one. It will do for one race. But that's annoying. What, that's three? That's race seven. We have 23 races. By epitome, we should run out of that second ERS. It will probably take longer this time. I ERS will take longer for sure. So probably you're looking around la race 15, 16, maybe 17. So like we're guaranteed another ERS. Engine, maybe. Because it looks like a lot of people have been held, have been held up. Yeah, Norris is faster than us, but we've got held up massively by Leclerc with both drivers. Let's go now when it's sort of quiet to do our lap. And hope. Russell! I might tactically call him in. If we didn't catch him with Albon early, should get out the way. Gasly should get out the way for this straight. We are P15. Uh, no point even trying to defend these positions. Slow on the end up. Got me. Just send them out and hold people up. I want Gazi to get through, but it's annoying. Albums oh, out in P17. Oh, that's not good. Those upgrades that other people put in really have hindered us. Yeah. Um, yeah, car parts damaged. I'm not gonna fix it. It's it's one like you think about it. We have two ERSs. So I think if there's a race that we're just really bad at, like if there's a race where one of them qualifies in the bottom five for when the other one qualifies the top ten. I'll just get that guy. Wait. A fresh, a full fresh engine. That does, it does take out of our cost caps. It's like we have to be strategical. I think I might leave. Keep the third top. I'm going to probably leave okay. 30 million left in the cost cap maybe. Or 20 million. By the end of the season and hope we don't ruin the cost cap i don't want to be i don't want this team to be in the mud we'll see how everything goes with crashes and stuff that's why i might pause development that's why i might just go straight to research whenever the third part comes in so then i don't have to worry about it okay no one come out now Share, held us up. Share, held us up. P10. Go in, go in. Okay. And we're out. P11. For share, held us up. We got held up by Stroll and push share in that lap. Always, I just wanted to go out earlier because I knew it would be crucial. Race day. Eh? 
So his ERS will get damaged and his ERS is already damaged. That is completely fine. Figure out a strat. Can I go this? Yeah, I can. Good. I want them to be aggressive. I just want to have it on aggressive. This is not what I'm actually going to do the entire race. I'll go aggressive at the start because I just want that to be shown. Um, okay, it's aggressive. We're not going to use ERS to start this race. It's going to be a very boring race. I'm just putting them on the same strategy. I want to jump people. Yeah, P11 for guys like P17 for Albon. Being held up is just, that's just the nature of this Monaco the of Monte Carlo are ready. or qualifying even. You'll never get a clean lap. It's time for one of the most exciting races in the world. This is it really Monaco though the most exciting? And, and it's time it's for the Monagas GP. Let's see what everyone else went on. Oh, hard, soft, mediums, yeah. A lot of people went hard. On hards. Ugh. Yeah, it's him. Oh, they're pushing. The RS enabled. Oh yeah, no, 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 no. Let's push. Let's push. Let's let's push. Charlie, please, seventeen. No, oh, let's push, boys. Let's push. Save ERS. As soon as I try to race anyone, I just have no trouble. Yeah, uh, hey, album. You're fine, buddy. Happen. Okay, back off. Could be. Now I'm gonna start backing off, so I'm gonna back off now. To drop back. With tires. Yep, yeah, okay. Do that. Yeah. This is this is this is the part of me of this race. It would be like, oh yeah, guys, well, let's just go and attack Sonoda, but he's on mediums. Everyone else is starting to conserve their tires, so I'm gonna conserve our tires. My box earlier. Like lap 44 or something, just to get on fresher tires. Hey, Albon! Over it. This, this race is beat. This race was over the second qualifying finished. Alcon overtakes Gasly. This isn't our track. You just tell. The tires are back up. You Ish. can increase the pace. Yeah. Tires are back into an operating window. You can push again, boys. You just have to decrease so then they stay in optimum tire temps. Actually, let me pause. Void high risk curbs. Void high risk curbs. And just tell them to flat out attack these tires. And see how well that does. If Fort Harris turns where they attack like mad. That does that benefit them or does that hurt us more? <laughs> I don't know. Wait, tire life is better. Our tire life's better. But our tires went cold. <laughs> uh uh. Alright, let's go now. Yeah, expended the tires by a couple laps. Not by nothing drastic. Is the car okay? I'm getting like 
weird yeah. vibrations starting my lips. Um, yeah, that's just expanded our tire life enough to where I think we can push the mediums till the end. Yep, medium tires are gonna start hitting. I don't like this. We're gonna get lapped. Like, we're so easily gonna get lapped this race, it's not even a joke. And we're five seconds off. Guys, um... Just tell them the fly I'll attack these tires. Alright, now let's go tell them to go back onto high risk avoid high risk curbs. Let's extend the tires as much as we can. We get to keep the pace up. And we're good. I'll take us to the end of this stint. Thank you, boys. Albon, you can go aggressive. You can attack your tires, Pierre. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. This race doesn't this race does not appeal to me whatsoever. It's Monaco. Hit window. There's no chaos. Tell you to go standard. The window is open. Copy. Yeah, I don't like this race. A lot of people have passed us. The Valbon. Not so much with Gasly. However, he does get overtaken by Sonoda. Yeah, this race isn't good. It's always the normal, boring Monaco GP. Um, what's up on now? Albon says his confidence is medium. He's about to be dead. He's about to be dead last. Hit from mediums, Gaza. P15 for Gasly. It's so down whenever pit stops happen. We have one of the freshest sets of tires. In theory, if we could, if we can somehow scrap our way to P13, it would be wonderful. Higher would be absolutely incredible, but I don't think that's possible. Especially when we have to give way to lapped car. To especially when we have to give way because we're a lapped car. Hold on. Hey guys, I attack those tires, please. Focus and push. Copy. Use your. We can use our fuel now. We look at push on fuel. Yeah. On Gasly. I don't want to put you on a high crest because we're on Monaco. Please, Gasly, make a move. Yes, I'll make another move. Make another move. Why aren't you making another move, Gasly? Gasly? Come on. Use the rest of your battery, brother. DRS is currently disabled. DRS is currently disabled. Hey, P13. <laughs> We're 31 seconds behind Hamilton. Who is ultimately right behind 10th? We are so far behind. I mean, we can see if we can close up. We've got 10 laps. And we're still in the pluses on fuel. We've been pushing for the last 10 laps. I mean, it would be a surprise, P10. 
We're not gaining enough. Could even get lapped twice. Albon's been lapped twice. Albon's, Albon's race has been over for so long. Yeah, unfortunately, buddy, you're probably P15. I mean, Gazi staying with Alonso. It's good, right? We don't have with fuel. Copy. Bro, we've been lapped. Low fuel, so be nice. He's been that. lapped twice. Yeah. Don't try. Don't chat to me. Wow, attack your tires. Wow, attack your tires. You can push. Copy. Hey, good news. Cut it down by 20 seconds. Over the finish line and today's so if we were just closer. Okay, Alex, that's the flag. If we had a faster car, we could have actually done bits. But that was probably the most surprising GP of them all. I thought Monica would definitely be a I'll safe be to go. It'd take a real optimist to find anything good about Alex Albon's race. Don't chat crap. That is, it's just the car, mate. It's just the car, unfortunately. <sighs> yeah, two laps, one lap for Pierre. Pierre had good pace, Albon just... I need to figure out what Albon's good at. I need to change his program. No points, Alpine technically close up on us. Rocher closes up, Alpine just fly away, Alpha Tari gain points. Not a good race. If we do get points for DHL pit stops, I feel like that's what our main goal which should be in now. Focus on that. We're only a tenth off, but it was been a pretty appalling weekend. Kind of glad I didn't do anything for sponsors' goals. But yeah, if you did enjoy Monaco, and if you did think it was going to be carnage, just drop a like, let me know. But yeah, until next time, see ya.